Where to start if you're a woman with low testosterone. I'm Marissa Fay. I'm a hormone and gut health expert for women. I help women reverse and reduce their symptoms with natural methods and actually feel better. I've been sharing a lot of posts over here about different types of hormone imbalances and how we address them from a functional medicine and holistic healing lens. I work one-on-one -on -one with clients. I also have a course, The Balanced Hormone Blueprint, where I teach my five-step method. That five-step method is very helpful for nearly every single type of hormone imbalance I've ever seen. When it comes to low testosterone, we need to think about what's upstream. What is the precursor hormone that has to be sufficiently produced in order to get testosterone? Because when it comes to your sex hormones and many of your other hormones, there's an order of operations. They funnel down from another type of hormone. And in this case, testosterone funnels down from a hormone called DHEA. DHEA is produced by the adrenal glands but there's signaling that has to happen. So your hypothalamus has to signal to your pituitary, and then that has to signal to your adrenal glands. They're two little glands that sit on top of your kidneys. These glands have a lot of really important jobs, especially in producing many hormones related to stress. When a woman comes to me who has low testosterone, first of all, I ask, how do you know? Because a blood test is rarely the best way to measure something like testosterone but let's say we do something like a saliva test to see how her body's utilizing testosterone and it comes back low. Then we shift our focus to supporting her adrenal glands. When you shift focus to your adrenal glands, you need to start thinking about what is causing stress in your body. This is going to be mental and emotional, but also really physiological. My five-step method works really well here. So the first thing you're gonna do is consider removing toxins in your environment, in your personal care products, in your cleaning product. Next, you're gonna shift how you eat and eat in a way that really, really nourishes things like these glands. These glands really need certain vitamins and minerals and are really picky consumers when it comes to those things. You need to be getting sufficient energy and you need to be balancing your nutrition appropriately. You also need to be building your stress resilience and physically removing barriers for your body to heal. And then and only then we look towards how can we use supplements to support your body? Because supplements are just that, supplemental. You can't ask supplements to do the heavy lifting that your diet, your lifestyle should be doing. So that's where I would start if I had low testosterone.